unload. Contract completed. Once and for all, YouTube world, I'm going to show you how this is actually done. Take a look down below, Steel River Township. I completed the Steel River supplies. So when you grab that fuel tanker, which was somewhere around here, I dragged it all the way across to here. I literally dropped it off right next to that red trailer that you could see to the right of my screen. It was literally just parked on the road. It was just right there. That's it. And I just dropped it off there, far from the box. I then went to the farm, picked up the consumables, drove them back. And when I drive it back, I would see the yellow arrow going down because for the fuel truck, it didn't do that. Then I went to the lumber mill, Pinewood Express, did the same thing. It's got the up arrow, you upload it to your truck. Then you download, if you will, you'll see the down arrow when you go there. Now that was the second item it wanted. When I drove my truck on the yellow square, and it does the cargo management, and you hit X or B or whatever to complete the quest, it magically took the gas tank that was right there on the road. I didn't even have to, like, get it on the yellow square. It just worked. Now, keep in mind, you may want to make sure that yours has 2,000, right? So when you attach, you can go to options, and you'll see a thing that says refuel. Just switch with the target, and make sure you top up the fuel of the tanker if yours is not full. Rumor has it that it's got to be full. Mine was full, so I didn't have to do that. I watched a guy playing for 35 minutes in the rain and night. He wasn't talking. He wasn't explaining anything. I didn't understand what was going on. He goes to drive in, and then his video just stops. He doesn't explain anything. And then another guy goes, oh, this is a tutorial in the description box. Doesn't even talk during the, the video. There's no commentary. You see him drive in and deliver the, the uh, fuel truck, or like the completing the mission, but you don't understand why it worked. And then everybody's down in the comments section. Oh, you got to do this. You got to do that. Uh, I drove around a couple times and I had to get the fuel tanker just right, you know, somewhere in the square there. I spent a bloody half hour driving around from different spots to drive it in to see if uh, the game was glitchy. No, this whole bloody time, you simply had to deliver the other two items first and simply have the fuel trailer somewhere in the vicinity. Like I said, I had it right along the curb, right next to the municipal... Uh, the, the right sign, if you will. And like I said, I could keep repeating myself. It's not going to change anything. And it just it magically did it. It magically turned in and completed the mission. So that's how you do it. And I'm not going to lie. I was annoyed. And I hope this video goes viral because it'll help a lot of people. And if I can make an extra nickel, I'm not going to lie. I could uh, do with the extra nickel. So if you liked the video, give it a thumbs up. If you didn't like the video, go ahead, give it a thumbs down. I'll make sure when you play the game, you go to deliver your cargo. It turns in all your vehicles in your garage, including your character. What happened to him? Did he have a stroke? I think he's dead. Well, that's what will happen to your character, and you won't be able to wake him up. And if you want to subscribe to the channel, look at that, he's still dead. That would be great, but if not, thanks for stopping by anyways. Take care, boys and girls, or whatever it is you identify as. And as always, stay safe, stay happy, stay socially distanced. And uh, I'll see all of you, maybe some of you, eh, maybe none of you, in the next video. That's it for now. That's enough rambling. Bye for now.